Varro. There you go, Varro. He <laughs> murdered that corner. <laughs> Um, my name is Navarro, otherwise known as only Navarro online. Um, this is my third season playing college lacrosse, my fourth lacrosse season overall, and this is um, my docu-series Against All Odds in his second season. Yep. <laughs> ah. Awesome. Not that, not that. Three, low one. Ravens on three, family on six, one, two, three, Ravens. four, five, six. Ravens. So for me, um, preparation is very important. I try to prepare for the season as best I can in the only way I know how, which is pretty much to spend a bunch of time playing as possible. So I'll shoot on goalie, shoot alone, shoot in my backyard, shoot at college. Um, or even do pick up, pick up games. So anything to kind of keep the stick in my hands, try out new moves, move at a high speed, and um, just continue to work on the things that have gotten me this far. Any chance I get an opportunity to do that, I want to capitalize on it. Yes, yes, come on, brain. What up, up? I need a hug, cause drugs be taking over. Shorty couldn't take it no more, she went low, guy. No stranger to a rum and soda. Met the chick while she was slumped over But good, I be good though, I can't complain I could probably cop a half a plane Drinking juice just like Jack LaLanne now I'ma strike it rich any day now You know I gotta get a plate now Virtuoso on the keyboard I rep that Easter seaboard Jeez, Lord, please leave the Z3 keys before you leave Don't sneeze on my shit Cause for she's, I'ma flip ya A pedicure foot slide in a slipper Trying to do the remix with Pipple Tell the violin that skipple Play the violin with dimples Life's ironic and it's simple I smoke good, fuck, eat, drink Drive nice car, wear all green, make First time I whacked off was a penthouse Now there's roses in the bath at my penthouse Billy Joel at the garden Should I get a skybox? When I traveled down to Morgan State to um, shoot on Pablo, he's a goalie there um, it was it was a really good experience, you know. Just I've never been on that field before. So much history there in terms of lacrosse. One of the um, first HBCUs to ever gain lacrosse. So a lot of history on that field. And then, you know, Pablo's a solid goalie. So it was pretty special being able to shoot there, play there, and kind of experience everything um, that you kind of read about and then you hear when you hear about the um, the Morgan State Bears lacrosse team. And I'm back on my grind A psychic read my lifeline Told me in my lifetime My name will help light up the Chicago skyline And that's why I'm Seven o'clock, that's prime time Heaven to watch God calling from the hotlines Why he keep giving me hotlines? I'm a star, how could I not shine? How many ladies in the house? How many ladies in the house without a spouse? Something in your blouse got me feeling so aroused What you about? On an independent sheet Trade it all for a husband and some kids 
you ever wonder what it all really means? You wonder if you ever find your dreams? So typically, um, I train with Khalil. If you watched last season, you know who Khalil is. I typically let him coach me everything lacrosse-wise. Um, this fall, I don't have any footage of it, but I've been working with K Reds, who's Michael Sowers' trainer. So working on my footwork, I've done that a lot in the fall. Like I said, sorry, I don't have any footage of it. But this winter, I got in a lot of sessions with Joe Barber, who is a local trainer. Um, in my area back in Maryland so a lot of sessions with him and he's somebody that really pushes me to expand my game in a very creative way in a very non-functional way and I think which has helped me progress a lot as a lacrosse player this winter. I just don't want to get copyrighted. <laughs> <laughs> I see it. Score here, score here. Need one, need one, need one. Good. Bang. Good. Get it. Yes. Ah. Bang that. Uh. Oh. Talk to me dirty. Talk to me. My outside foot to go back upfield. Of course, my stick punches. Okay, I'm punching straight up to this midfield. Okay, I'm taking two steps and I'm turning my hip, allowing me to shoot this. Okay, so my stick goes up. I'm turning my hip, okay? This is the same thing as like me shooting, all right? So if my hands are here, all I gotta do is turn my hip and let it fly. <laughs> yeah, it's an excellent finisher, good twister. Say that. Uh, good, re-attack, good. Hey, yeah, yeah, yeah. Ah, I thought he was gonna fly. I thought he was gonna come no, to no, me. Good. Uh, home, sit in it. Score? Mm -hmm. Cool. Twelve bucks he scores. Not bad. Not bad. Catch it on the move. That'll help me out. There you go. <laughs> That's what I want. I can line that up. Throw you some terrible passes. See that catch radius. See that catch radius. <laughs> Throw you some impossible. Hey, yeah, take that out there. What you got? I like it. Yeah. He's missing. Ooh, but that goes. That goes. He faded too, bro. Hi, instead of like a little toe drag. I don't even know if it's gonna work. I wanna be I wanna play some defense. I'll play legit. <laughs> the stick can get through. I ain't gonna lie to you. It's slow. He came out of it slow. Alright, so just the stick got through, but I'm gonna jam you there. Yeah. You feel me? Yeah, that was disrespectful. Bro, come on, bro. Bro, that was that none of y'all hit the Because I didn't like make it one motion. Mm -hmm. I like jumped out and did it. Oh, I, I see. To it. clear it. Mm -hmm. So I can just. Yeah. yeah. Uh, like I said, it just kind of came to me, but um, I don't know which is more important. Is it showing the shot or is it just showing stick to get under? Am I might. It's, it's the same thing, really. I think so, yeah. If I can just, uh, little push, bounce, uh, under. Mm -hmm. And I'm just here with it. Yeah. <laughs> <I'm> like, <laughs> you motherfucker. That shit work though. <laughs> Coming into our first spring practice, I felt pretty solid. Um, I liked how I was throwing, I liked how I was moving, I liked how the team looked. I liked a lot of what I saw. Um, obviously, playing at a small Division three school, there's their advantages and disadvantages. Disadvantages, you don't have a lot of guys. So, 
my school in total only has about 500 people, I believe. So obviously my team, I'm not going to have a 60-man roster. So it's sometimes it's tough dealing with the lower numbers. But um, you make it work and you get really tight with your guys. Everything was going good until this. Um, on a practice last week, I ended up making a dodge shooting. I got hit as I shot, and I ended up falling right on my shoulder. And I think it's an AC joint injury, but we're not sure. I got x-rays this week, and then I have a doctor's appointment tomorrow to kind of figure out some of the specifics of it. So, hoping for the best. Um, it's been really tough for me because... I've never missed more than a handful of practices. Like, I've never missed, I've never not started a game. So, for me, it's weird not being out there. It's weird watching from the sidelines of practices just because I'm so used to being there and, and playing. So, um, something I'm getting accustomed to, but I'm just hoping that I can kind of get out of this thing as fast as possible and get back on the field so season starts next week we have a scrimmage on Saturday which I think I'm out for the scrimmage hopefully I can get back for next week's game but we'll have to see <laughs> 